Hi everybody, I'm Rich Funky. What a big week last week was for New York State. We celebrated the return of the great New York State Fair, which was first held in Syracuse in 1841. This year the fair runs until September 5th, so you still have plenty of time to make the quick drive down the thruway to explore all the new things the fair has to offer. Big music acts ranging from the Commodores to Flo Rida, plus a huge midway and the traditional opportunities to learn more about New York's still vital agriculture industry. As tourism chair, I'm happy that we have made a significant investment in the renovation and revitalization of the fairgrounds to make sure it continues to attract top-notch acts and thousands of visitors each and every year. The 147th running of the Traverse Stakes was last weekend at Saratoga, the jewel of thoroughbred racing in New York State. Visitors come from all over the world to watch America's oldest stakes race and enjoy Saratoga Springs. Arrowgate, ridden by Mike Smith, won by 13 and a half lengths this year. If you haven't had a chance to visit Saratoga yet, I highly recommend it. Plan your trip at saratogaracetrack.com. We have to congratulate the Maine Endwell Little League Baseball team from the Binghamton area for their World Championship win over South Korea. New York's first championship team since Staten Island won it all in 1964. Back here in the 55th, the Fairport Music Fest rocked the heart of the village over the weekend with big acts and even bigger crowds. Best of all, the proceeds from the annual Music Fest benefit Golisano Children's Hospital, which is a cause near and dear to my heart. Thanks to Rob Birch, Andy McDermott, and all the volunteers who make the festival a big success each and every year. And finally, our children and grandchildren go back to school next week, so be extra careful when you're driving. It's great for parents when the kids go back to school. It's bittersweet for the students. I stopped by the City of Rochester's Back to School event on Saturday, sponsored by WDKX, to wish our youngsters good luck in the upcoming school year. But the fact is, luck has nothing to do with getting good grades. Get up, get out, be on time, be respectful, and do the work. That's what it takes. And ask for help. Everybody who's successful will tell you they all had a little help along the way. And don't forget to thank a teacher. I hope you have a great week. I'm Senator Rich Funky.